Also a variant of this coin that's worth right around a quarter of a million dollars in the shape. Really? Rick, we might have the Holy Grail coins here. I like that. I like that a lot. There's a possibility. Uh -huh. I'd like someone to look at it who just knows a little bit more than me. Sure. So do you mind uh, hanging out for a little bit and I get somebody down here? Sure. Okay. Great. Thank you. Appreciate it. Be right back. Me and Bondsman is all about making cash money, man. I'm hoping this expert comes in, tells him his coin's worth a lot of money. I'm the owner of American Coin Express. I'm an avid collector and lover of coins. I've been doing it all my adult life. Every coin is unique. It's like a fingerprint. Okay. A $20 lib. When we had the 1849 gold rush, America had a substantial gold supply. They started issuing the $20 gold piece up till, till then they only had the $10 gold piece. So that's why they call it a double eagle versus a eagle, which was a $10 gold piece. They made one pattern in 1849 the year of the gold rush and that's uh, sitting in the smithsonian today and basically priceless and then in 1850 they started issuing 20 dollar gold piece uh the liberty it was the highest denomination gold people had out there 20 dollars what are your questions or concerns about this coin that you would like me to evaluate i need to know the grade on it and uh, i know there's a variant of this year that's super rare and worth a quarter of a million dollars in this shape so take a look okay the variant is distinguishable by the back it was a design which was not accepted, but some of them were issued as patterns. There's less of them, and that's what...